The Hopkinton Board of Selectmen congratulated five Boy Scouts who achieved the rank of Eagle Scout. Okay, this is, a, this is our favorite time of the year when these go up. And actually, the one great thing about Hopkinton is we do this several times a year. Um, the Board of Selectmen will consider proclamations for Eagle Scouts for Troop 1. This is such a great town. I mean, we have so many Eagle Scouts. We owe so much to the parents and to the troops. Um, how we, we can produce them, it's just incredible. I'm just so happy to do this one. Okay, so we've got uh, George Daniel Bradbury, Joseph Harrison, Gabriel Lopez, and Zachary Ritterbush. We as a community are extremely proud, which is why we do this. We know your parents are proud, and we know your troop leaders are proud, and we're glad they're all here tonight too. Uh, I just congratulate all of you. Job well done, and uh, Hopkinton is for the better because of you and your parents and all that you've done for our community. Thank you. Uh, they needed to learn <coughs> and, and demonstrate commitment, trustworthiness, love of country, persistence, loyalty, strength, all the qual qualities that we, we want to see in our leaders. Each of the five Eagle Scouts talked about the major project they worked on to benefit the community. So uh, my name is Zach Ritterbush. Uh, my project was over at College Rock down Route 85 towards Milford. Uh, it consisted of replacing the benches that were in the College Rock rock climbing area and also refurbishing the trail sign post as well as scrubbing graffiti off the rock wall face um, and uh, printing out some trail maps <coughs> and large size trail maps for the trail sign. Uh, that was the essence of the project. Uh, I'd like to thank Mr. Barnes of the Conservation Commission for helping me out with the project and, and representing the Conservation Commission, giving me the opportunity. Great. My project was over, uh, it was called the Wiley Woods Project. Um, it was over by Franklin Road um, on the way to Ashland. Uh, it consisted of installing two benches, uh, a 15 foot bridge, and um, trail clearing. Um, two people I'd like to thank were my dad and um, Karen Bo uh, Bograd. They both helped me a significant amount throughout the process. So. I'm Nate Shingleton, in a Faith Community Church in Hopkinton. I, uh, in the parking lot, I replaced all these uh, dead trees and plants, these little islands in between the parking lot spaces to make it look nicer and uh, to help the greeting of new people. So we just replaced all those with ones that would live there and not die in the future. Replaced all the new mulch, put new grass in. I'd like to thank uh, Peter Mesit down at um, Western Nurseries in Hopkinton for uh, donations and uh, helping us plan everything out. I'm Gabriel Lopez. Um, my project was on Carl Martin tra Trail. Um, mainly it was of clear clearing up the trail of brush to make um to meet um Hopkinton Area Land Trust. Um they own the trail so to meet the requirement it has to be arm's length of cutting the brush and make sure that you can actually see the trail. We also had had to install two um replace one bench and then install a brand new one. Um it wasn't that bad. But we also had to <laughs> we also had to install a 12 foot 12 foot bridge from remove the old one because if you step on it you'll fall through but we will we put a brand new one on top and some of these guys actually help, helped me in my project and we also had to um, fix one more small small footbridge we just had to replace one bore on it because it was like cracked in half through the middle but overall um, the biggest challenge was weather-wise because every single day it was raining, which was unfortunate. <laughs> um, I'd like to th thank my parents back here, Domingo and Mercedes. Um, they helped me so, so much with it that I actually cannot thank them enough. And also I'd like to thank Jeff Ferber for, from Hopkinton Area Land Trust. He was, he was the guy that gave me the opportunity to do it. Hi, my name is uh, Joe Harrison, and uh, my project was down by Lake Whitehall here in Hopkinton. Um, 
I decided to create a new picnic area near the boat ramp uh, where families can um, picnic and I created a couple benches along the trail as well, uh, one of which being dedicated to a classmate of mine, uh, Brad, who passed away this past year. Um, it was a great project. I got a lot of help, um, especially from the Friends of Whitehall. Uh, they were crucial in helping me get permission from um, the Conservation Committee and all sorts of parts of the town. and. Uh, as well, the, uh, the uh, park rangers were a, a huge help in helping me plan and, and get everything done. Uh, lastly, I want to thank my dad. He was there every step of the way. So, thank you. Uh, just by virtue of the fact that you found this goal and you found ways to help out your community and your dedication to the community, it really does make you uh, leaders in your community today. So, uh, you know, we want to thank you and uh, keep up the good work. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.